Hello and welcome to part three of my Pokemon Sun Wonderlock. In the last episode, we started fighting our way through the uh, trainer school, as well as getting another encounter and trading it off. If you're unsure of the Wonderlock rules, then watch part one, read the description below, all that good stuff. Before you watch this episode, if you don't want spoilers, re-watch last episode. And away we go, we're about to do a team recap, so quick, click off it now if you don't want spoilers. Let's go. So, we have level 8 Carnivine, called Carnivine, who has Synthesis, Bite, Sleep Powder, and Leech Seed. Next, we have Wommel, the level whatever it is. I can't see it. Where is it? Where is it telling me? Where is it telling me? Right under its name. Idiot. 13 Acuity Fly with Absorb, Fairy Wind, Stun Sport, and Silver Wind. All of the wind. My Wommel has wind. And last but not least, we have Habitac. The Pidgey, uh, no, they, <laughs> the Spearow, all oh, these Gen 1 birds look alike to me, racist. Um, the level 10 Spearow with Peck, Growl, Leer, and Pursue It. Okay, so, before we go inside and go and see the teacher on the second floor, which is where we've been summoned to, I'm going to go ahead and go back and heal, if I'm allowed to. I am, lovely, lovely, got that freedom of expression, freedom of movement, let's go. I am not a prisoner. Let's go heal up. Heal me up, buttercup. There we go. Bing, 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 bing. Thank you for waiting. You're welcome. Goodbye. We hope to see you again because we're sadists who like your pets getting injured. So. So we have to go into the school and up the stairs, which is the only bit we- Oh, Lily's back there again. So it's the only bit we haven't really explored yet, so that's good. Right, so, up to the stairs. Hi. Yeah, I'm going to avoid you for a second. Let's see what else is up here, shall we? Let's have a mooch. There's a slow poke. What are you saying? Slow poke yawn is a mood that can put you up on a sleeping battle. When a Pokemon is asleep, it can't do anything until it wakes up, so it can give you a chance against a Pokemon you're having trouble with. Thanks. Okay. What else we got? What else we got down here? Another doer. Another doer. Oh, another classroom. All Pokemon have some sort of ability, but even members of the same species don't always have the same ability as one another. Which ability you'll want your Pokemon to have will depend on how you like to battle. True. When you begin to level up as a trainer and learn advanced strategies, you'll want to pay attention to abilities. They can be a huge help. Let's see here. If you, so if you choose to view a Pokemon's summary, you can see what ability that Pokemon has. You touch the eye for more information, you can see what that ability does. Maybe I'd remember it all better if the textbook wasn't written to be so boring. Didn't you just call your own game programming boring? My little put picked this up. Here, you take it. Oh yeah, that's why you go and speak to everyone, guys. Even though I haven't been, clearly. It's an awesome ability. Oh, Lilliput's ability is pick up. It's an awesome ability that works even when you're not in battle. I went all the way to Akala Island to find a Lilliput and catch it just to have this ability. Well, that's a bit sad. Abilities are basically special skills all Pokemon have that can make special things happen. Take the ability called Limba, for example. Any Pokemon who has that ability won't ever be paralyzed by an opponent's moves. Find a Dursey. Let's go. Let's go. Is that the end of the line? Okay, now we'll talk to the teacher. He has a very Lily-esque voice. Hello. Ibiza. Oh, you can't believe that you beat all my students. Fantastic. After seeing such such a performance, I think I'd like to battle you myself. What do you say? Are you ready to save me on? Yeah, I am, because I went and healed up, because I am always ready. As a teacher, I've got to see for myself what you did to beat four of my students. Well, what it was, mostly, was that they absolutely suck. Uh, they all have, like, one Pokemon. Yeah, teacher Emily. So, that's, that's, that's the main issue, is they all suck. Oh, Magnemite, she's got two Pokemon. Um, answers for Magnemite are a little bit few and far between at this point in the game. I feel like we can sort of deal with this a little bit with Carnivine, because Grass resists Electric, doesn't it? Oh, it does, I know my typings, go me. Get to sleep, thank you, get your one eye closed. Yeah. Oh, it does, but... I'd like to see, like, instead of just its eye turn from a dot into a line, I'd like to see, um, like, an actu actual eyelids close. That'd be good. That'd be a great good. That'd be a great good. 
Get leech seeded as well. Okay, we are set up now. Now, doesn't steel no longer resist dark as of like a couple of generations ago? Um, because people, the Game Freak realised how overpowered steel type really is. So with that in mind, I think we can get away with doing a bite. A bit of a bite. It's, doing, it's been a good, it's been a good little magnemite. Staying asleep. Bite. Yeah, it doesn't resist. Beautiful. 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 And we're back to full health. If you could go ahead and stay asleep for one more turn, that'd be terrific. Yes! You're my favourite Magnemite I've encountered in this game so far. Thanks to that. Oh wait, is this going to be enough? Oh, it isn't! Oh, it's going to wake up now and spoil my good time, isn't it? It's going to wake up and spoil my good time. Yep, there it is. Yep, there it is. It's not going to do much though, to be fair. Watch it paralyze me just out of spite. Just out of spite. A crit! Guess a crit. I mean, I'd rather it crit me than paralyze me, to be honest. So, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with the situation. Meowth, a lowland probably. Oh, which means we won't have much of an answer um, with Carnivine because we only have Bite at the moment. Let's go Habitac. We're not that far ahead in terms of levels. Let's go Habitac. Keeping that OG cry. Just slightly updated. Yeah, it's a lowland. Okay, so good decision being made there. Oh, it outspeeds us and it's got bite. Oh, don't flinch us. Wow, that did a lot of damage and flinched us. Wonderful. Wow. Okay, can you not and just say that you did? That'd be... Oh my god, really? Is this Serene Grace Meowth? What in Tyronation? What in the tiniest of nations? Okay. Oh my god, got a high roll as well. Oh, whoopsie, got a high roll. Okay, I think what we're going to have to do, in fact, is growl this thing down a little bit. This is lethal. This thing is lethal. Oh, the crit! Oh, we didn't get thingy though. Flinched for once. Still, two out of three ain't bad. Good enough for Meatloaf. It's probably good enough for this Meowth. Okay, this is this is a bad situation. I mean... Wommel, Wommel can probably eat. Right, okay, we've got a growl off, and Wommel resists bite. So yeah, we, we should just switch to Wommel. Let's not be too proud to switch. Let's not be too proud to switch. We've got the growl off, we resist. And we have a super effective attack. Look at that! Okay, well done. You know what, um, Habitac? You did good there. You did your job. You did your job. Uh, fairy Wind or Silver Wind? Probably Fairy Wind. It's got more PP. Both are super effective. Ooh, nice. Oh, it's got Scratch. Okay, but we still lowered its attack, so who the hell cares? We might be able to knock it off with an Absorb now and get some of our health back. Not that it matters, because we're probably going to go to the Pokemon Center after this. Anywho! But, it's the principle. It's the principle, isn't it, guys? I only had 4 HP left. Sit down. That was, that was a challenge in Meowth. I mean, apart from the fact that we had Wommel to just deal with it. Sensational. You don't look... that that Your face doesn't match your words there. You're very incongruent. You're very, like... Your face is, oh, I'm so upset! And then your words are like, sensational! That was amazing, I'm happy! You know. Silly teacher. Nice! Maybe you'd like to take over as teacher here for me. No, I would not. All joking aside, though, I do want you to take these from me. It's a little reward for me to be. Whoa, whoa, I'm like 10. Ease up. Ease up, teach. Oh. Oh, right. Five great balls. Lovely. Great balls already? Really? They're great balls. Great balls are better at catching Pokemon than normal Pokeballs. You don't say. No, no, your Pokemon and know their moves. Those are the basics of being a trainer. You're still waffling on, mate. Waffling on. How about it? Greetings, Captain Illima here. I couldn't help but observe your battles. You looked so very delightful in battle that I had no choice but to summon you here. This is Beza, who moved to, to Alola from the Kanto region, dude. He's got a real sense for how to use moves, and I think he's going to go far as a trainer, yeah. 
I see. Then welcome, newcomer. I look forward to seeing the brilliance of your moves in my trial. Indeed, we captains are the ones who conduct the trials you will face on your way to challenging the island Kahuna. My trial is held in Verdant Cavern, the trial of Captain Ilma. You can find Pokemon living everywhere, even in the patches of tall grass in Howley, Howley City. I can't say that. Perhaps you will want to fill out your team a bit before attempting my trial. Perhaps. Perhaps. I sincerely look forward to your challenge. I didn't check. I should have checked on Mustard in the last episode where the trainer school and Howley City are different, re different places. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. I reported to the folks upstairs about that tour that was blocking the road out from it again. That guy's tour is pretty much a celebrity here on Millie Millie, you know. Well, I guess it's time we dismiss you from school, Abaser. Or was that her? I don't know. Wonderful. So I don't get to go upstairs. Be good to your Pokemon. And try to follow through with those status conditions too. Yeah. I don't want to follow through, thanks. Good luck with your island challenge. I hope you get close to a lot of new people. I hope you let me just walk out of here. Oh my god. Abaser, enjoy your island challenge. And be sure to use the skills you... I think it was different people talking. Whoops. You learned how to train at school. Good luck, future champion. Are you all done? Oh my god. Make sure you use that TM. Make your Pokemon the strongest. Show them what you made of it, Baser, dude. Can we just shut up and let me go? It's this anime thing where everyone in a scene has to talk. You seem to be in perfect sync with your carnivine, weren't you? Um, since we've come this far together, why don't I show you some other city? Why don't you just go away? Can't stand Lily. Come on, there's lots to see. No. Leave me alone. Ah, oh, so does this mean I can't go back in? I want to know what was upstairs. Oh, good grief. Hey, sir, over here. I'm going to go the other way. Oh, come on. <sighs> Hope you all enjoying the movie with me. You know, I was really impressed seeing how you battled with your Pokemon at the trainer school. And even back when you weren't yet a Pokemon trainer, Ibiza, you were able to save Nebby. You were chosen by your Pokemon so quickly, I understand why now. Oh, I forgot about Tauros. Can Tauros, like, impale you on one of its horns, please? <laughs> Ow, having a great time. Oh, wait, no. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, if it wasn't Lily and Ibiza. Sorry for scaring you, friend. I guess it's time I get all to us back home. Oh, but why don't you give him a little pat first, Ibiza? Uh, okay. Whoa. This is too much to pet that big old to us. If I had a pulse, I'd... Put, display the text slower. <laughs> you see that? This rascal already loves you. Pokemon become happier when we show them some care. Blah. <laughs> Oh, the place is your go, child. And as you do, uh, you, you surely meet more Pokemon and people who will enrich, enrich your life. Oh, the Kahuna sure has something, eh? Able to calm a raging Pokemon without even needing to battle. Now that's something. I mean, like, I like Taurus plenty and all, but it's pretty scary. I don't want to ride on it. Get it? Ride on? So, where are you two off to now? I was thinking I would show, I should show Ibeza around how old the city a bit. No, you know what you should do? You should show how off the edge of a cliff and, and escort him, as in go with him. That'd be fantastic. Nice idea. You're always on top of things, Lily. Ibeza just got here to her, Lola, huh? Then let me tag along too. I want to go get something good to eat. You just... How about that poison? All right, let's all go together. Then what are we waiting for? This way, come on! <sighs> Someone get that boy some Ritalin. Oh, how? I guess we should go catch up with him before he gets too far, Ibiza. Holy city is the biggest city in all of Alola. All of Alola. Right, anyway. I don't know about you, but I'm ready for a nice stroll around Holy, especially the beach. Yeah, I I want to go, uh, I want to go back in here. And see what's going on upstairs. That's what I want. That's what I want. Do these students just never move or go home? Like, they just stay in school all night. Right. What was going on up here that I missed out on, potentially? Oh. 
Absolutely nothing. Oh, what are you what what are you saying? What are you saying? I will not move from the spot. There's a first one train ahead. I would fear for your safety in there. Huh? When do we come back to that? I don't think I've ever seen that in the in in all of the one times I've played this game. When do we come back to that? Huh. Huh. The plot thickens. Oh, I'm gone. Wait, how's our team looking? We should heal up. Didn't we take, like, a beating? Oh, no, never mind. We got healed up because it's Pokemon Sun and Moon. Yep, I remember. I remember we're playing the easiest Pokemon game of all time. I remember. Let's go. Cutscene Simulator. 2018. 17. 17? This game is already nearly two years old. Three years old. We've had Ultra Sun and Moon as well. Was it 16? Was this 2016? Good grief. Cutscene Simulator 2016. Whatever the year is, the joke works, right? Right. Beach time! Yeah! Hey you! You've come to a lull of um, some place far off, haven't you? I can tell, because I'm a racist. You don't look like you're from around here, boy! Then let me teach you the proper way to greet someone in Alola. Alola! Okay, I think she's Mr. Kennedy. You give it a try too, just like that. Alola! Oh god, with the voice crack and everything. You'll make more friends if you say it. If you speak our language, we'll let you stay in our country. Uh, right. So... What are you saying? Looking good. I mean, thanks. That's a bit of a weird thing to say to a ten-year-old boy, but whatever. Whatever. Let's go. What are you saying? Ground-type moves won't reach flying-type Pokemon, right? So they don't do any damage to them. But water-type moves will wash away any ground-types. They're very effective at that. This is just like your Sun Lounge chat, is it? Okay. People people in the Pokemon universe are so, like, obsessed with Pokemon. It's weird. Like, it's kind of like, if you imagine everyone in the real world that you encounter, like, the checkout girl at the supermarket and, like, the cleaner at your work and and everything like that. Just all your workmates and, and all your friends and everyone. Where the hell is how? Everyone just talking about the exact same topic. It'd just be so strange, wouldn't it? Like, every every single person, say, for example, likes football. Everyone, though. Everyone. No one has an opinion that's like, oh, no, I don't really watch football. Just everyone likes football, and all they ever talk about is football. Like, how strange would that world be? This, th that's the Pokemon world. Except it's about Pokemon, not football. I mean, Pokemon are animals, so it's kind of like if everyone on the planet was just an animal lover, but all they ever talked about was animals and how they interact and and what the favourite type of animal is. You know, like, if you just walk, if you walked up to someone in, in the street and you just let on, you go, oh, hiya, you know, just as you walk past someone, and they respond with, you know, I think I prefer dogs to cats. That's basically what happens in the Pokemon world, and that's that's pretty strange if you ask me. Do I have to? I don't. I don't. Hey, Ibiza! I thought I recognized the sound of those. Recognize the sound of those feet. Yep, yeah, that's not a weird thing to say at all. Do I have to do the camera nonsense with that guy? So, what do you think? Cowley is something, eh? I don't know. I've not had a chance to explore it because you won't leave me alone. Alone, that's got to be the best place ever to live. Yeah, except you're here. Oh, yeah. Hey, Beza, come in here with me. I've got a good idea of something you could do. I've got a good idea of something I could do as well, but it would stop this being a PG channel. Hey, miss. That's not true at all. I can't. He basically plays games as a PG channel. I play GTA and Hitman and all sorts of stuff over there. Hey, miss. Is it true that you can get some kind of special gift if you have a Rotom Dex? My goodness, you get the news fast. It's almost like we have the internet. Hardly anyone has a Rotom Dex, but it's true. We have a special item to go with it. It's our very own Pokefinder. Here you go. 
Awesome! You're not even getting it, dude. Chill out. Isn't that awesome, Ibiza? You got a Pokefinder. So, like, what's a Pokefinder? Pokefinder is a tool that lets you take photos of Pokemon. Oh, yay! It's just what I want. I was just thinking, you know, I, 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 I'm I, sort of torn between continuing this Sun Wonderlock and ditching it for Pokemon Snap. Autumn will help point out places where you'll be able to take photos, too. None of my watch you won't. Here, I'll read you the instruction manual. Uh, tap on Autumn, I'll press R. Yup, that's all it says. Quite simple, isn't it? Yep, just like you. Alright, can we go? Man, that Rotom Dex is cool. It's like a whole nother partner it is. Yeah, it's like, I'd much prefer Voltom to you. Can you go away? I mean, on top of your Pokemon partner. Oh, right, you didn't mean you. Okay, well, still go away. Oh, but I guess it's, I guess since it's a Rotom inside, it pretty much is a Pokemon partner. Either way, you're pretty darn lucky. Meet you outside when you're done in here. Excuse me, yeah, missed you, so little it, oh. The photo is you can stop a Pokemon with a Pokefinder. They are simply too cute to resist. Sure, it depends on the picture and the Pokemon. What are you saying? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I know, look at you. You look like a Pokemon trainer with sense. I've got something I'd like to ask a promising looking trainer like you. What do you say? I'm listening. Oh, oh, thank you. That's wonderful kind of you. You see, I'm here doing some research on various Pokemon. We need to recall the differences between ten species of Pokemon for my survey sample. I've been working so hard and my back is just killing me. Then you came along. You're like a sensible young trainer, which is just the sort of person I need to help me. I'd like to ask you to catch 10 different species of Pokemon for me. It's not too much to ask, right? Good luck out there. Okay, so I'm guessing I haven't got 10 yet then. What are you saying? So that's 10 Cart Hill. Apparently only locals are allowed to go in. I wonder what kind of Pokemon live in there. So local hill for local people. Melee, melee islands, melee, melee meadow. Home to <laughs> just bird Pokemon. That's what it says. Yeah, say that 10 times in quick succession, love. So we are going to have to do this nonsense with that bloke, aren't we? Oh, more cutscenes. Ibiza, how? Did you visit the tourist bureau? How was it? It was rubbish, Lily. We got this Rotom Dex upgraded. Now I can take pictures too. Yeah, because no one has a smartphone with a camera in it in 2016, right? What a wonderful helper you are, Wilton. Wish I could say the same to you too. Thanks for taking a picture. I'll be sure to delete that immediately. Huh? <laughs> Wait, how does how laugh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what was that for, Rotom? Go and put that little trickster bag in your baggy baser and follow me. He's already in the bag. Enough feasting for the eyes. It's time we take care of our stomachs. Yeah, and skip that photo guy, right? Maybe Rotom just wants to flaunt his new camera function and take more photos. Have you thought about trying it out? Nope, not even once. I think I'll go stop by the app apparel shop to do some shopping on my own. Who says apparel shop? Surely people just say clothes shop. Apparel shop. Right, anyway. Oh. Yo, trainer, look what you've got. You lucky kid! If you've got a Poke Finder, then I guess I'll give you a little tip. I'd rather you didn't. Honestly, I'd much rather you didn't. See that spot where the wall is cracked? Take That's a photo spot right there. Look at that! You wrote him there, he's trying to tell you too. Give him a tap. Find his keepers and this finder is mine. Press R whenever you see the icon change. Must I? Firing up the Pokefinder. You can move the camera all around by using the circle pad. So it's a good idea to try looking at the world from di all kinds of different angles. When the time is right and you frame the perfect shot, press R or the Ableton. Each time you fire up the Pokefinder, you can take six picks before you run out of space. Okay, well... You're taking all the pics you can in one go. Let's shuffle along the photo selections. Z -z -z. What kind of photo do you want to show the world, Bucko? Would you like identical photo number one, identical identical photo number two, identical photo number three, identical photo number four, identical number photo number five, or identical photo number six? These jokes would work a lot better if I could speak. Uh, let's have number one, because that's the one I would have gotten. Z -z -z. Is this the best shirt you've got? This is the best shirt you've got? Okay, insulting. Your photo's been uploaded, and the comments are already pouring in. 
Take a picture of a cool Pokemon next time. All right. Not, not Pikachu. I'll get you. Whoa, what does that one say? Two up from that. How do you Bujian Le? Fantastic. No idea what that says. See? This way you can see what kind, what all kinds of different people think of your pics. I got 731 thumbs ups. Here you are. Look at how many people gave you a photo of thumbs up. This is a pretty sweet pose. That's a sweaty. Oh my god, that's a sweaty feet photo, pal. That's a pretty sweet photo, pal. You hit a new high record, kid. You're just blowing, blowing me away here. Wonderful. Seems like you can get version 2 if you get a total of 1,500 thumbs up on your photos. Just a little, fur little bit further, kiddo. Don't give up now. Get me out of this tutorial. The whole game is basically a tutorial, but get me out of this particular one. Oh, what was it? Did you get a good shot? I hear it's best to try to photograph Pokemon from the front, you know? You get arrested if you take pictures of the bum holes. I, I want you to know more about the Pokefinder. Well, just keep taking ton just keep on taking tons of pictures. I can't remember what his voice was. It's not important. Go away. Plenty of shots to check out in how old even an Apple shop. If I had a buddy, I'd go. Um So is this a new area? Like Is there any way I can like Alright. Alolan Grimer. Oh, hang on. Back. Habitat. Right. So is this all one place, I guess? There's the... Is that the school? Wait. 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 That's the Pokemon Center. This is the school. That's where I caught Mustard. Do you know what? I'm going to have to test. I'm going to have to run back. And I'm going to have to find out if at any point the area changes. Okay, so this is the beachfront. So is that a new area? Music even changes. Oh, this... Wait. The trainer school is still in Route 1. Oh, it's kind of not legal then. Oh, I don't even care. It's a different area. It's the trainer school. I don't even care. It's the trainer school. It's a different area. Get over it. Get over it, anyone who's moaning about that. Yeah, it doesn't change, but... Do you know what? No, it's trainer school. It's trainer school encounter. I'm... Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Right, so that means we haven't had a Haoli City encounter. We haven't had one on the beachfront or in the main portion of the city. So with that in mind, it's time to go get some encounters to finish up the episode. I think... Um, I, actually, I don't think we can get a beachfront encounter. I don't think, I don't think there's any any actual grass before we get yeah through into the next bit. Whatever though, we're gonna get an encounter here. That's fine. Okay, so actually, I'm gonna go ahead and say, it's it's just one for how old this is. It? Okay, so what's in here? Oh, can get out the other side. Very nice. Well, we didn't want to do that. We want to. We want to get a Pokemon. So here we go. Just the one encounter, then. Just the one encounter. Pichu. Okay. Very nice. Carnivine can deal with Pichu. No worries. No worries, mate. No worries. I reckon I can even bite it once. 
Use charm. Can definitely bite it now. Can definitely bite it now. Harshly fell. No wonder I had such problems with Hal's Peach. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's a thing. Okay, right. Overkill. One more, actually. One more, actualmon. Lowering my defense as well now. Oh, really? That was like a mega high roll. Damn it! Oh. Well. They always say leave your audience on a disappointment. So. I'm going to leave this episode here for now. <laughs> um, leave a like if you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new here. Share with your friends if you think they would enjoy. Uh, today's question of the day. Today's question of the day. What's the most annoying, pointless feature in a game? Like that being able to take photos of Pokemon. Like, what's the most annoying feature, pointless feature in any Pokemon game? Let me know in the comments section what you think down below. But for now, all I have left to say is thank you very much for watching. As always, I've been Ibeza, you've been amazing, and I'll see you next time.